Hello! Welcome back to new GeoGuessr video. I'm doing accent not because I want to be offensive, but because we always end up in rush at least one, maybe two times per every round. So, uh, you know, you have to, how do you say, uh, get in right mindset for it. Hey, uh, real quick before we get started, shameless self-promotion, in case you missed it the last couple days, I did just release a new track of my own music track that I made with my own two extremely messed up calloused hands. Uh, here's a little preview of it. And if you want to listen to it, it's the first link in the description. Hopefully you'll check it out. But uh, anyway, let's get started. We're going to do some worldwide hardcore mode uh, because I feel like tormenting myself a little bit more with not being able to move around. So let's see where we are. Hey, look, it appears that uh, we might be in Russia here. What do you know? It appears that my accent in uh, introduction might have come in handy a little bit. You see, I, I am in the right mindset already. We have to try to find Riceb and Can and Hinempa. That. Oh, I don't think this is going to work very well. That's, I feel like the ones that are further away are going to be more significant cities. It's giving us this first one, Riceb, because it's really close by, but it could be a really small city. But if it's identifying it when it's farther away, it's probably bigger. It could very well be in Ukraine. That's also very possible. Well, you know, as much as I would love to spend the next several hours scanning across Russia at different levels of zoom, I think I'm just going to throw down a guess kind of over here so that we could be in Ukraine, we could be in Western Russia, I don't know, but just something like that, watch it be completely on the, actually that's, that's not terrible, um, but also, we're not, wait, hold on, what, what country is that, wait, what, what country is that, oh my god, I just, I just learned something new today, I, I didn't know. I did not know that Russia has a little little thing over here. How did I not know that? Did you know that? Did you know that Russia had a little thing over here? Am I an idiot? Did I miss out on like World Geography 101? But I, I didn't know that Russia had a thing. I didn't know about Russia's little thing over there. It's just, it's a little isolated thing. Ha! Huh. I ain't even mad about not getting super close because now I learned something new today, which... I probably should have known for a long time, but you just didn't. Oh, okay. How very interesting. All right. What are we what are we getting at here? Um, I'm not entirely sure, but let's see. Are you Okay, so we're driving on the right side of the road? Oh god, I can't actually tell what side of the road that truck is driving on. Oh, we got Okay, we got some Are those dairy cows up there? Now, where where would we be getting dairy cows? Also, what? Oh, God, I really don't know. I'm feeling like this is probably Europe somewhere, but I also don't know for sure, and it would be really... It looks like... Okay, I'm assuming that we're driving on the right side of the road because this sign would probably be facing the other direction if we weren't. So, okay, we're driving on the right side of the road, and I'm kind of feeling like we're somewhere in France, maybe. I might be totally off, but I'm getting I'm getting the French vibes here. I don't know why exactly. I think I remember maybe on a previous one, we had a sign that looked like that, and it was in France. So that's why I'm going to go with it, and I might be totally, totally off. But let's just go for it and see what happens. Hey! Hey, not so bad, right? I got France. All right. I can live with that. We're not on track to 20,000 points, but that's okay, because we discovered that that's Russia. You're the first people in the world to realize that. Not even the people who live there realize that they're living in Russia. Like, we're in some unincorporated area somewhere in... That's an effective way to block off not wanting cars to cross. Just throw some rocks down. You know, we, we've we had uh, some people cutting through our neighborhood unwanted using ways, which I have as well. It's actually really frustrating. I'll be honest with you. As much as I do like me some technology, it's... There's way too many people who drive by during rush hour as a shortcut, and it's real annoying. In any case, pardon my venting. Well, I'm definitely feeling Europe once again. Now, where in Europe would these boulders be native to? I, I don't know. I'm feeling like it's probably Western Europe somewhere. I just don't know exactly, though. Have we ever actually had something in Germany? I feel like we've never had Germany. So I don't know if it's just not on the list or what, but it feels kind of weird. Let's see, Pyrenees. Aren't the 
Pyrenees a mountain range in France? Are we in France again? I just know of the Pyrenees because it's like they go over them in the Tour de France, the bike race. So where are those? Gotta be somewhere in France. Oh, hey, there we go. There we go. All right, hey, let's just uh, throw it down somewhere in this area and kind of hope for the best, right? 53 miles away, hey, pretty good. We're doubling up on France this time around, but that, thank you, random trash bin for having the only bit of language that just gave it all away. That's wonderful, actually. Oh, goody. Welp, this could just ruin me. South Africa, Australia, Brazil, Oh, man, I'm gonna go with Australia on this one. Uh, you just always, I feel like there's some sort of, it always has to give me Australia or South Africa. One time each round. It just has to do it. You can't, you can't just let me enjoy myself and do well. Nope, you gotta throw me Australia. Uh, well, let's just, uh, it tends to be in, like, you know, southeastern Australia when we get it, so... God damn it. God damn it, it was South Africa. Ah, I'm gonna die. Ah, uh, why? Why do you do this? If I had guessed South Africa, it would have been Australia. It's inevitable. What are you? A was? Do we have any more signs? Uh, e, parser, something, e and something trading. Okay, getting getting South American vibes out of this one. Um, hold on. No, it could be Indonesia. It could be Indonesia because Petronas Towers, Petronas, and this this could this could be definitely Indonesia. The the scooters. That's also a lot of them in like Southeast Asia. Uh, I'm just gonna guess near Jakarta. And kind of hope that we're doing all right here, yeah? Oh, hey, not terrible. It works. It works just fine. But I was right about the Indonesia thing. All right, I'll do it. I'll give myself a little bit of credit for that one. Fifteen thousand points on a game of hardcore. Which, if I had just, if I had taken my fifty-fifty chance and thrown it the other way, that might have been my record score for hardcore mode. So now I'm really disappointed. Damn, that was. I did pretty well there. Let's try this again. That's good. It's a good one to start off with. Yep, real good. Definitely the best. Definitely what I was hoping to get. We're gonna throw the old South Dakota guess out there because I'm feeling the United States on this one. And uh, it was not that, but it was in the United States. So where were we? We were in Georgia. All right. Well, you know, the South Dakota guess, I have no regrets on it. Okay, next up, what do we have here? Um, Feeling like we are in French Canada somewhere potentially speed limit 25 we are not in french canada it was it looked like the um the street sign was you know kind of french ish and so that's why i thought that but then i was like mm, nope definitely not all right so united states suburbia somewhere um if only i knew those area codes there are two of them on that one so that doesn't help at all either where, okay, so we're double the United States to start. It's like what we had for France last time. We have for the US this time, except the US is slightly larger than France. And uh, so therefore it's a tougher guess. Uh, and we also don't have a trash can to easily identify where we are. Um, I'm gonna guess kind of up here in, in Michigan, maybe. Don't ask me why I'm thinking Michigan, but it also might be the world's worst guess ever. Yes, it is. Yes, it is. We're near Dallas. Alrighty then. That's okay. At least we got the country right both times. What are we at? Uh, so we're, okay, somewhere in South America. I'm pretty sure. Or we could be in Brazil. I feel like I should just guess Brazil because it always tends to be Brazil. It's never Mexico, ever. I'm gonna guess Brazil on this thing. It's gonna be the one time that I actually do guess Brazil and it's not. But that's okay, we'll just guess kind of down here and uh, see what- Hey, my God! I am a brilliant person. I really, I was almost thinking, because of how green it was and mountainous, it made me think of Rio. I was like, maybe I should guess even closer to Rio, but eh, I should've. I really should've. That would've been sick, but that was also not bad. That was like the first time we've ever done a quick guess to Brazil and had it work properly. 
Are we, uh, are we in the U.S. again? It kind of feels like the U.S., I'm going to be honest with you. Dude, having these grooves on the side of the road, that's it. Oh, yep, speed limit 65 miles an hour. All right, you're throwing U.S. heavy on this one. And I am not sure if I like it because the U.S. is very large. This could, uh, this could actually be somewhere in California, honestly, or Texas. We don't have too many concrete highways, though, in California. You get stretches where it's concrete, but more often asphalt when it's in... Yeah, but it could it could be. I'm actually I'm gonna guess California on this one. We'll see what happens. Okay, it was it's Colorado. It's not terrible. Things could be a lot worse. I was kind of right about the general region. It wasn't up in the north, you know. How about where are we at now? Okay, round five out of five. We're not beating our score from last round, but are we even gonna get any points at all this time? See, I would think Sweden possibly. It's not. It doesn't have the dotted edges of the road which is making me think it's not i don't know i'm still i'm kind of feeling sweden on this one i get not every road in sweden can have the the dotted on each side that can't be like every single one there's got to be some exceptions to it so i'm gonna just guess it but closer to europe in case it's not actually in sweden not bad not bad at all Woo! all right i i hedged my bets pretty well on that one there we go it seems like it's pretty often to, they have that kind of architecture on on buildings there. So it's a bit of a giveaway. Uh, in any case, though, not too shabby. Not too shabby. Okay, let's view that summary real quick. I feel like as a whole, at least we got the country right every time. What do you know? Very heavy on the U.S., though. Uh, at least I can identify my home city. Anyway, I guess that's it for now. So thanks so much for watching. And you know, I'm not terribly disappointed with how that turned out, other than the Australia-South Africa thing. But let's be honest, that's bound to happen every time. So anyway, thanks so much for watching. Make sure to like if you liked. And uh, again, if you want to listen to the new track that I released, it's it's linked. It's playing right now. It's in the outro. And you can click on it. And it's linked below. Uh, anyway, that's it. I'll see you next time.